I'm Dr. Priyanka Reddy, Fertility Specialist, Motherhood Hospitals, HRBR Layout, Bangalore. What is hysterosalpingogram or HSG? In a hysterosalpingogram, we use an X-ray to help us visualize the fallopian tubes. But as the fallopian tubes cannot be visualized through a transvaginal ultrasound, we need to use a contrast dye which can be passed through the uterus into the fallopian tubes and at that point they will be taking an x-ray. How do you prepare for a HSG? HSG is basically performed between day 5 and day 10 of your cycle. During this time, you will be asked to come into the hospital. An injection will be given, could be a painkiller. After half an hour, the patient is asked to lie down on a cot with an empty bladder. A thin tube is passed through the cervix into the uterus and a dye that is a contrast dye is placed into the uterus. As we push the dye in, an x-ray is taken. If the dye fills the uterus and goes into the tubes, we will be watching if there is a spill. So for this, a series of x-rays will be taken. The dye that is spilt into the pelvic cavity will be resorbed by the body. If the dye does not spill on either of the sides or both the sides, it means that the tubes are blocked. If there is a tubal block, could be unilateral or bilateral, what next? So for a blocked tube, there are two ways of looking at it. One, we go ahead and try to do a recanalization, that is an operative procedure. Or if both the tubes are blocked, we go ahead and do an IVF cycle.